Go ahead. Okay, so this is the fourth part of the skull uh, landmarks, and we're going to start with a stylus, a styloid process. Styloid process looks like a stylus. It's part of the temporal bone, point of attachment for muscle, and for our purposes, it's important because it points right to a foramen, the stylomastoid foramen, right where that stick is going in and that's between the mastoid process and the styloid process. So styloid mastoid, stylomastoid foramen is where the facial nerve exits from the skull. We have the superior concha. I already showed you the uh, middle concha. You can't see the superior concha in the skull, so you don't have to worry about it. Um, temporal process. Temporal process is named for the bone it touches. It's part of the zygomatic bone. So this is the temporal process of the zygomatic bone. This is the zygomatic process of the temporal bone, and the two things together form the zygomatic arch, and I think you can probably see the suture across here. It's a little difficult to see on the white skull, so I'll show it to you on the colored skull. Okay, so here is the zygomatic bone. This is the temporal process of the zygomatic bone. This is the zygomatic process of the temporal bone, and the two together form the zygomatic arch, sort of like a drawbridge, and you can see it's hollow underneath. Then we have the zygomatic arch. So this is the zygomatic arch. We have the zygomatic process of the temporal bone. That's this. And that's it.